Hello my dear friends today i am going to discuss with you a software named ansys so ansys means analysis systems it includes a lot of systems so now today we are going to deal with a small problem a cantilever beam so this is our problem a cantilever beam of a span 200 mm and containing a load of 100 newtons in the downward direction and a fixed support so the cross section area of this beam is 25 by 25 so let us look at the basics of this one so let us go into the software directly this is our software so it contains many systems as you can see so our beam comes under static beam so static structural so double click on it and we'll get a pop up like this so rename it as cantilever not necessary but you can so the first one engineering data so double click on it so in engineering data we can assign materials that we want so click on engineering data sources in that general materials we have so many materials and non linear materials we have many materials so let us pick any one material from this one so let me pick any one so let me pick uh, this concrete so click on that icon check okay fine we have got that one close that one now double click on geometry which opens uh, the design modeler actually so this is the interface before going we can change the units as we need here and if we have three plane select any of the one of the plane and uh, right click on it click on look at so here we got it now take a rectangle click drag and click next go to dimensions it will be general so click drag click click drag click so we have to give the dimensions over here it is 25 horizontal and 25 vertical we can enter now if we go to modeling if we click on this button we'll be getting isometric view now click on extrude so it is asking geometry so select the sketch which we have drawn now click apply you can see the depth as 30 change it to 500 oh sorry uh, change it to 200 as our span is 200 click on generate so we have got our beam can um, beam you can see the other views also so we have completed our geometry just close it you can observe a tick at the geometry and the remaining steps so double click on model which starts mechanical so this is our interface we need to assign the material which we have picked up here so expand the geometry click on solid and you can see uh, the material assignment is structural steel that click on it and uh, sorry click on it this is the concrete which we have assigned it before now click on mesh so expand the sizing in that relevant center will be having coarse medium and fine so depending upon this uh, requirement we can choose i choose medium and click update that's it we have got our mesh so if we want to observe the elements and nodes just click expand statistics yes these are the number of nodes and elements in it now we have to apply fixed support here so look at it just click on that static structural now we can observe all those so take a fixed support here is asking geometry where so there i need a fixed support click on apply and we have to apply a load over there so let me click on it so as you can see we the entire face is selecting so we have to select the edge tool edge yes edge tool now you can observe that the edge has been selected so go to loads and force click on force now it is defined by vector so change it to components we can observe three components x y z components so we need the load in the downward direction that means in the y direction so in y component i give 100 actually 100 i am giving minus 100 
which indicates the negative direction means in the downward direction so click enter yes you can observe that we can observe uh, we can check our supports sub fixed support and the load here now click on the solution we need equivalent one mice stress here so we can uh, check any other stresses also we can check the strain energy we can check equivalent one mice and all the other things also now click on equivalent one mice you can click solve here or right click on it and click solve so the solution is being processed and here we got our uh, analyzed beam you can observe all these colors and the values of these colors here there are beam bent like that and uh, there is the maximum one here you can observe the red strings and you can observe the maximum stress what we have got here is 8.2 into 10 power 6 pascals so we can observe the animation also expand it uh, Select the sec number of seconds you needed. Select the number of frames. I prefer 10 seconds and 100 frames. So just click on play. That's it. Our beam is going to bend like that for that uh, 100 newtons load for the concrete material. You can change the materials and you can check uh, the stress here. As you can see, observe the colors. So we can take down the uh, readings like that. Thank you so much. Thank you.